All right. The, there's problems with these cases um, in that most of them have what they, we call a delayed reporting. Um, people that are victimized in sexual crimes are a lot of times embarrassed because of what happened. Sometimes they live with the perpetrator, but for whatever reason, they typically delay the reporting in these crimes. And what that does to us as uh, law enforcement is it puts us behind the eight ball as far as the investigation goes because we can't do a test to test, in, in, in this case, the toxicology level of, of somebody who's had too much to drink. We can't go and do a DNA uh, comparison uh, because the time has passed where that's no longer viable. So most of the time when we're dealing with cases of this nature, we are dealing with a purely testimonial case and it makes it very difficult to convince juries uh, that just based on testimony alone that, that somebody committed the crime.